Today I'm reading Isaiah 53. Who has believed our message? To whom has the Lord revealed his powerful arm? My servant grew up in the Lord's presence like a tender green shout, like a root in dry ground. There was nothing beautiful or magentic about this appearance, nothing to attract him, us to him. He was despised and rejected. A man of sorrow acquainted with deepest grief. We turned our backs on him and looked the other way. He, ha he was despised and we did not care. Yet it was our weakness he carried. It was our sorrows that weighed him down. And we thought his troubles were a punishment from God, a punishment from his own sins. But he was pierced for our rebellions, crushed for our sins. He was beaten so we could be whole. He was whipped so we could be healed. All of us like sheep have stayed away. We have left God's path and followed our own. Yet the Lord laid him laid on him the sins of all of us of us all. He was oppressed and threatened harshly. Yet he never said a word. He was led like a lamb to the slaughter, and as a sheep is silent before the before their sh sh shars, he did not open his mouth. Unjustly commanded, he was led away. No one cared that he died without descendants. That he. His life was cut short in midstream, but he was struck down for all rebellions, for the rebellions of my people. He had done no wrong, and he had, and had never dece deceived anyone, but he was buried like a criminal. He was put in a rich man's grave. But it was the Lord's good plan to crush him and cause him grief. Yet when his life is made an offering for sins, sin, he will have many descendants. He will enjoy a long life. And the Lord's good plan will prosper in his hands. When he sees all the that is accomplished by his anguish, anguish. anguish, he will be satisfied. And because of his experience, my righteous servant will make it possible for many to be counted righteous, for he will bear all their sins. I will give him the honors of victory's soldier because he exposed himself to death. He was counted among the rebels, rebels. He bore the sins of many and incident for rebels.